Hey there, welcome back to my channel. My name is Brittany Bundles and today is going to be another vlog video. Today is like the, I think the third day of me vlogging. I'm not really sure what we're going to do, but I'm definitely going to take you all with me and let's go. All right, so we are out of the house now. Um, we're about to eat lunch. Um, I got shrimp and grits, which was really, really, really good. And um, after lunch, we took another walk um, to the market. Um, this market was really interesting. I saw a lot of things that um, I typically don't see, you know, at home. So I was trying to see what type of souvenir I wanted to get for my family back home, um, particularly my grandmother. She really wanted a souvenir. I did not find a souvenir in the market, though, um, that I decided to get. I actually got a souvenir someplace else. But these baskets are so beautiful. Um, they are hand weaved i believe is the correct terminology and um there's a lot of history behind these baskets and they look so beautiful um the information as far as the pricing and things like that were located on the bottom of the baskets and i believe the baskets were in the price range of i mean they all varied but the smaller baskets were like 50 to maybe 80 dollars and then the medium-sized baskets were like 100 to 200 dollars so um but they were really really sturdy and very good quality so we were looking at the baskets i think my cousin ended up getting a keychain size um basket um, i was considering getting a basket too but i decided not to uh, at this point i'm just looking around to see what they had and what i wanted to get um, just trying to find like, you know, like I said, the perfect souvenir for my family um, and even for myself. So I was just looking around trying to see um, what there was to see and what I wanted to get. And that's that. At this time, I was a little bit tired because we have been walking for the majority of the time that we um, were traveling. And, you know, I'm trying to get better with my fitness and um, just being more in shape, but you know, I have been slacking. So all of this walking for me was really, really exhausting, although I really enjoyed the trip and I enjoyed seeing everything and experiencing so many different things and it was peaceful. The walking part was definitely excessive and it was a lot. It was a lot. My, my legs were hurting. So after the market, we walked to this, um, I don't know if I would call it a beach, but it, it may have been a beach, but we walked to this place. Here's what it looks like. Um, I'm just sitting down trying to catch my breath and it's really, really pretty. Uh, the water's over there. Um, you know, they had people that were dancing and uh, the music was really loud and just it was a whole vibe. Now, the reason that I decided to do a voiceover and not have just the, the natural um, sounds playing through so that you can hear the music that was playing and the people and kind of get a feel for the vibe, too, is because I did not want another copyright claim. Even right here, I was speaking. But then when I went back and listened to um, this part, this clip, I heard a lot of music that I feel would have gotten another copyright claim or, or you know, it, it just wouldn't have been good. So I decided to voice over this part as well. But pretty much in this part I was just letting you all know that we decided to stop for a little bit and sit down and that um I was just tired from walking and um what else was I talking about I think I was just talking about uh where we're at and that um you know after we leave here I'm not really sure what we were going to do but we decided to stay here for a while and watch the show um this show was very very interesting they were playing music and dancing they even um were interactive with the audience and brought different people up on I don't want to say the stage but you know what I mean they brought other people up with them to um, do different dances and they had like a big finale at the end and it was really really entertaining and interesting I mean I wish I could do those moves um, I remember as a child I would watch different shows and see people dancing and you know doing things like that <laughs> and I would wish that I could do them um, not saying that I can't, but I never mastered those skills. So it was really, like I said, really, really entertaining and interesting. And I just enjoyed myself. I really enjoyed myself watching this. Um, they also had, um, like tip buckets. So you can go ahead and show your appreciation after they get done dancing. Um, right here, we decided to go ahead and leave the, um, 
leave the place that we were at and go back to our hotel. So that's what we're doing right now. Just going back to the hotel, going back to the room to kind of freshen up and see what else the day has for us. Um, this trip, like I said, was very, very exciting and fun and peaceful all in one. Um, so right now we're on the highway and we're on our way to the beach. Um, so this is where uh, we decided to park at the beach. And I don't think I was really saying anything, um, or I may have been, I'm not sure. But um, after we parked, we decided to go ahead and walk. Now we did have to walk quite a bit to get to the beach. I think this day I ended up walking over 10,000 steps. And that may sound like not a lot for some people out there, but for someone that doesn't walk like that, 10,000 steps was a lot. And my legs felt every single step. So um, that's what we're doing. We're still walking and I'm just kind of taking everything in. It felt so good especially to get away from Michigan for a minute. Like around this time in Michigan, we have some nice days, but the days are really cold. Um, and, you know, they were cold where I was at as well sometimes, but this particular day was really, really nice. The sun was shining. Uh, the breeze was perfect. I think it was like maybe 75, 77 degrees. And just look at the view. Like the view is beautiful. It was beautiful. It kind of took my mind off of how tired my legs were just seeing the view. Um, so I did take some pictures. So if you are not following me on my Instagram, please be sure to check them out. Um, or check out my Instagram. My Instagram is Brittany underscore bundles. I believe it's linked down below this video. Um, but just look at the scenery. Like it is really, really pretty. And I continue to take different uh, shots of the scenery of the sky. The sky is just so clear and so pretty. And it just looks like a postcard. Like it literally looked like I was walking through a postcard. Once we arrived at the beach, the beach is breathtaking. It's so gorgeous. Um, it just is so pretty. So here's what the sand looked like. In the sand, I could see um, seagull footprints and, um, you know, just different things. Now, we did not become beach ready. Um, I did not have like a towel or anything to sit on so I decided to sit on my jacket and then we also found a log to sit on but look at that little seagull it's so so cute and you can see their footprints their footprints are like right there so so cute So um, this is not the only beach we went to. I do have some pictures and also videos of the second beach that we went to. I loved both beaches, but if I had to choose one as my favorite, it would be the second beach that I posted on my Facebook. Um, and I may post it on my Instagram as well. But um, yes, that is what we did. Um, here are some pictures of the uh, beach, like the way the walk toward the beach I just wanted to insert them so you can get another view of everything. It was really, really gorgeous. All right, so we finally made it back to the hotel room. We decided to go with nachos tonight for dinner. The nachos were loaded. Um, they were really, really good. So that pretty much wraps up the day. Um, it was a very um, exciting day, but like I said, it was still relaxing. Um, my legs were extremely, extremely tired extremely tired. I know I said extremely, extremely, so ex I apologize for that, but they were very tired. I was so happy to be home. Well, not home, but you know, in the hotel and just ready to eat and relax. And after I got done eating, I took my shower and I really just crashed. I was super exhausted. So I do want to thank you all for watching this video. And if you have any other video suggestions, feel free to leave them down below. I will see you all in the next video and um, yeah, talk to y'all later. Bye.